Hey guys, so this is my first YouTube tutorial on myself. I'm normally a lot more comfortable being like behind the camera doing it on my girls, but um, I had some requests to show how I do like my beachy curls. So I'm gonna do that for you today. I'm gonna do some beachy waves into a fishtail on the side. Be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe and let's get started. So first what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna comb out my hair. Um, I showered this morning and I do not ever really blow dry my hair. I just let it air dry, so I'm just using my wide tooth comb and just going over my hair. And now I'm just gonna take my big and sexy spray and play and just do a real quick spray all over my hair. Like that. Now I'm gonna section it. I do my hair in three sections. So I'm gonna do the bottom half first. And let's get started. So I'm gonna take, I think this is a two inch hot tools curling iron. So I'm gonna put it halfway, wrap, pull down. I do not bring the ends all the way in. I'm gonna hold it for just a couple seconds and let it out. You see how the ends are straighter? I don't like super tight curls. So I'm gonna take another section. I'm taking probably half inch sections, nothing too big, but nothing too small. I have a lot of hair, so it takes a long time for me to curl my hair if I do it like super precise. But I like beach waves just because they can be messy. And again, I'm leaving the hair out at the bottom and curling. See, that's what it looks like, super easy. Now I'm gonna come over to this side, go midway, curl, pull down, curl, pull down. This technique kind of takes a little bit of practice. Um, I used to start from the bottom and wind all the way up, but I just found that I like this way better. So you definitely will have to practice like the hair not getting tangled. And sometimes even my hair still gets tangled in the curling iron, but it just takes some practice. All right, so now that I'm done with my bottom piece, I'm just get the hairspray, spray it out, and section. Now I'm gonna take about an inch and a half above the ear, maybe two inches. Give it some spray. get started. Do the same thing. Go for the middle. Twist. Pull down. Twist. Pull down. And let it out. My hair curls pretty easily and holds curl pretty easily, probably just because I've colored it so many times. So I actually like my curls best the next day. I'll put my hair up in like a bun while I sleep and then the next day I feel like my curls look the best. side. Don't hold the ends in. And 
All right, so now I'm done with that. I'm gonna spray. Take my top bun out. I'm actually gonna section this one four times. So I'm gonna just take a little piece up at the top. And continue doing the same thing. As I get to this layer, middle, Sometimes I'll try and alternate forward and backwards, but I always start at the front of my face. I always go backwards. I don't like the curls when they wrap around my face. I like when they go away from my face. So right here, I'm gonna go the opposite way. So I'm gonna have this part sticking away from me, just cause I feel like it helps give a little bit more volume the curl I leave the end out and let go and then this one I'm gonna do away and sometimes I'll take my fingers on my hair and kind of spread it out evenly so it all gets the same amount of heat And you can see my hair kind of has a natural wave to it um, when it's air dried. So I just feel like that helps like with the beachy look. Now this I'm gonna go away. But I only do the alternate facing curls on my lower layers. I do not do it on my top layer. All right, so now that I'm done with that layer, I'm gonna spray. Take out my bun. I don't really have a direct part of where I part my hair. So I just kind of shake out my head and just wherever it falls that day, that's where it's gonna be. Spray it down. So for my front pieces, like I said, I always curl away for my front pieces. But right here, I'm gonna take <clears throat> about half an inch piece. I'm gonna go to the middle, but I'm gonna pull in front of my face. And let it out. Do you see it's here? And just on those, I do that just because I don't like when my hair is like all the way back here, it just fits my face. A little bit better. So now I'm gonna do the same thing over here. Take about half an inch, place it in the middle. I'm gonna turn it. And as I pull, I'm gonna pull forward. Turn it, pull forward in front of my eye. Turn, pull forward, and let go. All right, so now that I'm done, you see how my curls are super tight? I don't like that. So I'm gonna just spray it down really quick. And now I'm gonna take my fingers and just brush out my curls. And now I'm going to take my 
my um, spray clay from Style Sexy Hair. And I'm gonna lift up, and as I spray, I'm gonna let it, my hair fall. And I'll even do some at the top. And now, I'm gonna take my Kristen S water-based pomade. I just take a little bit, that much, rub it in, and go through my curls. Gives you nice big volume. And so this is the beach wave. So if you just want the beach wave, here you go, this is perfect. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a cute little fishtail on this side just to give your hair an extra little spiciness. All right, so for the fishtail, I like to keep a couple pieces out in the front like this, but you're gonna go at the top. You're gonna take about a half an inch, you can see piece or almost an inch, you're gonna split that in two. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take hair from outside, normally underneath, and you're gonna bring it across into the other hand. Take hair from outside and bring it to across. You can see it's starting to make that fishtail. Outside, bring it across outside bring it across we're gonna just do a couple more of those and then now what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna do a normal fishtail all the way down so I'm just gonna take from that strand of hair to the next then take from this strand to the next I'm not really doing exact size pieces. I'm just kind of pulling over whatever I bring. They can be big or they can be small. All right, so I'm not gonna go all the way down. So here you can see that's your fish tail. I'm gonna take an elastic. Right here, I'm gonna put my elastic. And now I'm just gonna start using my pincher fingers and pull the braid apart. All the way up and all the way down. And sometimes you'll get hair, like straggler hair that shouldn't be in there. You could pull that out. So basically, this is what it's gonna look like. You can just do the normal beach curls or um, add a little braid. I did a fishtail, you can do just a regular Dutch braid or a French braid. And now I'm just gonna spray it down. And this is the final product. All right, well, thanks for watching, and if you guys have any videos that you want to see or want me to try with my hair or the girl's hair, just let me know. Bye!